Ladies and gentlemen, here is a quick tutorial on the Facebook application on an iPhone 6 Plus. I want to share with you how it works. This recording may not be the most ideal recording as I am not recording with a mixer. However, I think that I would rather show you how this interface works and uh, defer high quality audio for a new podcast that I'm going to do on this. Since I wanted to make this very quickly and provide some very quick information about the iOS version of Facebook, I thought that maybe this would be a good way. So let me switch over to the Facebook application. App switcher. Phone. Active. Messages. Mail. Facebook. WhatsApp. Facebook. Actions available. Facebook right there. All right. Notifications. Too new. That's Facebook is loaded. Let me share with you a little bit of layout information about this Facebook application, the main page when you load it. As you may have heard, there's a notifications to notifications that were just announced. Let me tell you from top to bottom what's on the screen. On the very top left hand corner of the application is search, search button. And then I'm going to do right swipe with a single finger. I am holding my iPhone with my right hand and I am using my thumb finger to swipe right. This is a great way to get through the different controls in an application. So this is the Facebook application. I'm going to right swipe again. Clear button. Clear. I'm not sure what this button is for, but I'm just giving you an overview here. Message friends button. If you want to message your friends, you could do that. Status button. There's a status button, so you could put in your status. Photo button. Photos. Check in button. You can check in. What's on your mind button. Uh, of course, what's on your mind, that's always good. Button. Well, the new Facebook application has introduced a couple of unknown buttons that I'm going to be reporting to them, but that's a button there that I'm not sure what it is yet. Two hours, everyone. Okay, that is the Facebook list or news feed. Typically, when you go to the Facebook mobile site on your computer, you're going to have a news feed. Here is the news feed. But let me skip through all this because as you right swipe what's going to happen here is you're going to be right swiping through all the statuses that your friends are putting up and i'm going to give you some examples there it is now let me go to the bottom left hand corner of the application selected news feed button notice that it's selected news feed all right you're going to have a couple of or few buttons on the bottom of this screen here, the next one is request button. Requests. This is where you get your request that you have completed. In other words, uh, friends that have accepted your friend requests, or if you have any suggestions for friends. And I'm going to show you that a little bit later. Messenger button. Messenger is the that so that you can load the messenger application and open it up so you can send your friends messages. This used to be, this particular feature used to be integrated into Facebook, but it is now a separate application that you have to install. Notifications, two new button. There's notifications, and as you can see, I have two. More button. More. And under more is where you can get to your profile so you can do things in there such as privacy information, your groups, and so on. So let me go back to the news feed. Notification messenger request selected. Four hours selected. News feed button. Looks like I went a little too far, but I'm in the news feed. Let me go to requests. Request button. Friend request heading. Friend requests. Find friends button. You can do find friends here. Accepted friend request heading. You have accepted friend request. Other user friend request heading. And then you have friend requests here. Jammer, jam, conf, delete. Is it 20? Conf, delete button. People you may know. Heading. And then you have people you may know. I went through that pretty quick because of the names, but I'm going to go through it here and um, then I'm going to just remove the names from the recording. Computer science tech division. Image. Computer science tech division. 57 mutual friends. Dip, add friend button. Okay, there you go. So you can add friends here. Let's go back to the bottom here where it says requests. Messenger button. Selected. Request button. Messenger button. 
I right swiped to Messenger. What that will do is launch the Messenger application. Let me right swipe again. Notifications, two new button. Let's go to the notifications here. Notifications, heading. Message friends button. You can still message friends in your notifications here. So you can right swipe, right single finger right swipe and get through all your notifications and then act upon them by double tapping. So let me just bring up one here. Okay, I'm going to double tap here. Back button. What that does is it opens the notification, that particular notification, so you can review it, you can like it, you can um, put your comments in there, and I'm going to go through it really quickly. Search in Equal the Momentum. Clear button. Equal the Momentum. Secret group middle 184 members. Showing. Okay, notice how it took me to the group, and in here I can see all the posts in this group. Let's go back to the tab down here on the bottom side of the screen. Selected. Notifications. Button. There it is. I'm going to right swipe now. More. Button. There is mo the more button. I'm going to double tap on that. Search. Notice it said search. That's on the top left. I'm going to right swipe. Message friends. Button. You can still message your friends. Jose Tamayo. View your profile. Button. You can view your profile. Friends. View your friends. Privacy shortcuts. Privacy shortcuts. Groups. Groups. Log out. You can log out. Saved. There's everything that you've saved. On this day. And then particularly what's on this day. See more. You can see more things. Edit, edit, button, heading. Favorites, heading. There's your favorites, so you can edit your favorites. 100 entrepreneurs. And these are Actions your groups available. now that are Leaders favorites. Coming. Interesting days in groups. Actions available. And then there's groups. Privacy shortcuts, add favorites, privacy shortcuts. There's Actions privacy available. shortcuts. Add favorites. Add favorites. Settings. Settings. Privacy shortcuts. And more privacy shortcuts. Help and support. Help and support. Log out. You can log out. Newsfeed, button. Request newsfeed. Newsfeed. Notice how it got back. That's because it reached the bottom of the screen. And now I am at the newsfeed tab. Remember, there are some tabs across the bottom. Newsfeed is the first one all the way to the left. Then there is request button. requests. Then there is messenger button. Messenger. Then notifications button. Notifications. And then selected more button. More. And then selected more button. You can't do any more. Okay, guys, this is not a comprehensive overview but i will be providing additional details in a future podcasts about the facebook mobile ios application this is for iphones and ipads and ipods have a nice day